Good evening everybody. I'm starting my vlog on an evening today which is really unusual. Um, just had a full day at work and I've come back and actually on the way home I went to the three store because I really wanted to upgrade my phone today. I've used it for two years and just it's such a mess. It's cracked everywhere. So I thought let me upgrade. So I went to three and their whole system was down so I was unable to upgrade my phone and I'm like wow like this is just my luck. It's something that would only happen to me. So I'm pretty unhappy about that, but I think it's a sure sign telling me to go to the gym. So I'm about to go to class with my housemate. And then after that, Navid is picking me up and we're gonna go get some food tonight. So I'm super excited because like I said, life begins after work. Body attack tonight. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Will. <laughs> My freaking... Right, we're on the way to Body Attack, yeah? And I'm pissed off. Absolute piss. <laughs> it's like a freaking reality TV show. <laughs> but basically, I came home yesterday and I was like, you know, I've got four loads of washing to do. But I thought, I, you know, I can't do it tonight because I'm tired. So I thought, today, let me do my washing. And then somebody in the flat has used all of my freaking washing powder it's empty it's not even there's not even like a tiny tiny bit left it's all gone the whole thing is gone they so i'm like why obvious. why would you use someone else's washing powder so today i've been unable to upgrade my phone and freaking someone's used my washing powder and that is the evening that i'm having tonight and it obviously is not great I bet you my gym card doesn't work tonight because it's like you've not been to the gym for two weeks because you went to Cal South Korea and it's just going to reject me so we'll see what Happy days. we'll see how that goes I finished class and I came out 10 minutes early because Navid is already at my house so I'm about to go and meet him now probably do a really quick change and then we're going to go get dinner Hey darling! Hey, what's poppin'? Hope everyone is doing good. How? How's everyone doing? How's the room? It's not exactly Versace. No, but it looks really nice. It's so obviously knowing Regina, she's always clean and organized. You can see everything is perfectly decorated. <laughs> like, Regina, I need to learn organization skills from you as a... Do you know what? You've actually... Done, I'm improved. You've improved. Are you you're such a Regina? you're such a good blogger. Thank you. Not as good as you, Regina. You definitely need a YouTube channel. Do you think so? Yeah. People, if you think you should have a YouTube channel, then comment below. Okay. And uh, well, guys, what's popping? Let's get it. I'm gonna give the first gift to Navid because he's. Oh my god. <laughs> Go on, do your acting like you've never known. Like this is the first the time I've ever. <laughs> yes. We're a reality TV show. Just act. Is... Okay, do do I'm um, acting like this is the best thing you've ever seen. Well, it is the best thing I've ever seen. So it's like, it's so amazing. It's super cool. You know what, guys, I always do a facial because I feel like facial is the best thing to kind of take care of your skin, make your skin shiny and glowing. So thank you so much, Regina. Okay, Honestly. now act like, this is, act like this is not what you expected. Yeah. <laughs> how did you find, how did you like find Korea with the facial masks and stuff? Like I just ask Did that everyone. Even make sense? Yeah, I ask everyone who is popular, like which brand. So wow. sometimes I go for Face Shop, and then I go for Innisfree, and then I've heard it's that really Medi Heal is really popular. So that's why I went for this one this year. Yeah, guy, and you know this is the best thing, so it's always important. So just make sure, especially with London weather, you just want to make sure that your skin is glowing. So obviously I love it. Thank you so much. Do you know Regina. how to use it? Yeah. So basically, as you take a shower yeah. after the shower, yeah. once you dry your, you know, yeah. your face. Yeah. You just apply the mask and just leave it on for like a good 30 minutes? I would say 15. Or 15 minutes? Because once minutes. it gets drier, then um, once it gets drier, it, the, the actual pad, the what is it, the yeah, face yeah, mask, yeah, yeah. can absorb the moisture back off your skin. Oh, so I I'd say don't leave it on too long, I'd say 15 minutes. 15 minutes. And then should I just remove the mask basically? Yeah, and that's okay. it, and go to sleep. And the next day, Perfect. do your normal routine. You know what, originally, you should definitely do tutorials on how to use facial masks because I feel like people might not have that knowledge let's do it we'll let's do together. it yeah so make sure you guys stay tuned okay so i've just chucked on a big baggy white t-shirt and a skirt and that is the post gym look for me today i say it's like the first time i'm in a car like so close to my home right um, and he goes oh yes don't worry but um i've crushed this car so many times 
even though I'm still learning to drive, um, don't worry, Regina, you're in good hands. So just like relax, enjoy, and just put your seatbelt on. <laughs> No. Guys, he's just like crossed three lanes, like <laughs> without even. I don't even know. Are we gonna be okay? I think so. You just have to make sure that you keep your seatbelt fast and relax, enjoy. And if you need any assistance, don't hesitate to ask. <laughs> I would like to say that I love my family and I love my friends, except Navid who kills me. No, you, you, everyone. I'm joking, I'm joking. Oh god. Okay. Is that to us? No. Excuse me, can you come down? Now turn off to the You're getting too rude nowadays. I don't think you can ride across like any white line that you want to though. Don't worry, when you're in Navid's car, your safety and security is my priority. <laughs> I feel like I'm talking to a robot and the robot's like malfunctioning. Everything will be fine. Just relax, enjoy the beautiful scenery and just think that you're on holiday. Guys, I'm more on edge in this car journey than I am on a community locum shift. Oh, really? Are you serious? Okay, guys. <laughs> so, what's happening, y'all? You know what? Let me tell y'all something. When you drive, you need to be determined for three quarters of a mile. that thing needs to shut up while I'm talking. Um, you need to be motivated and just like really go for it. Like, life is too short. Um, okay. I'll see you. If this was a test right now, would Navid pass? would have failed! Don't worry, many people have said that, so it's not under you. <laughs> Look, guys, it's 20 miles per hour and I am going 20 miles per hour. We so went earlier on, you were going woo! And driving really fast. Yeah, because you know when the roads are empty, you want to kind of go fast. Because sometimes it's a bit fun to have that acceleration. You know, it's that adrenaline rush, right? Yeah. We yes. arrived at Westfield, y'all. Uh, we're gonna go just to see what's in store. And I'm really excited. Uh, let me tell you something. I don't mind eating anything. I'm just on a strict diet because I'm trying to get six packs. You trying to get a six pack? Yes. Wow. Because I'm obviously nowadays heading to the gym and I've got a personal trainer. Who are you trying to impress? I'm trying to impress myself. Because wow. I love myself, y'all. Navid, Navid was the one who taught me that um, I should be able to sit in a restaurant by myself. Oh yeah, exactly. Because I feel like if you love yourself, you can do anything you want. So make sure, never rely on, rely, don't rely on anyone. Be independent and don't let anyone crush you. Okay. You know, I'm just talking about the driving test and I passed on my fourth time, y'all. Fourth well, time. What I can say to you guys is that I passed my third time and because twice I had the same examiner. So he so did I. Are you serious? Yeah, this is a horrible I had, woman. Um, I had the same examiner twice, and then he said, I'm sorry, you failed. And I was like, oh, for God's sake, please. I don't want to keep paying 60 quid or whatever. Is that what I'm you like, said? Yeah, I was like, please. I'm a very hardworking person. I'm a pharmacist. <laughs> I was like, please, can you just make me pass? Like, I will do anything, please. They were like, so, he was like, sorry, this is a driving test. I don't give a crap about if you're a pharmacist or not. And I was like, excuse me, I'm a professional person. He was like, I don't give a crap. And then, thank God, the third time I had a different examiner and I passed. So that's my story. Wow. Literally, everybody stares at Navid whenever we're, I'm out in public with him because of his outfits. So the, today I've got Fendi Prince Swan. Fendi Din Swan. Fendi Prince Swan. <laughs> so is Versace completely finished now? No, you guys, because I thought, you know what, Versace is getting too repetitive, so I need to blend it in with a bit of Fendi, because obviously I do have an Italian background, and Fendi represents my Italian ethnicity. What's Versace? Oh, Italian as well. Sorry, is that but, why? Yeah, but is that why? Do you, be, do you choose based on your race? Yeah, because I just feel like it's my the personality, country. and I just want to represent it. <laughs> Look at the gorgeous Regina. Regina, what do you want to say to your fans? Um, keep glowing in my face. No, I'm joking. I don't have any fans. But Regina, um, your face is glowing. So like, what advice would you give? Is it just the facial mask? Korean face masks. And uh, Korean beauty, Korean makeup, everything Korean. And Regina, can I ask you one question I've been bursting to ask you? Yes, please ask. How do you, keep, how do you have so much energy after a long day of work? I think it keeps me sane. Do stuff after work. Life begins after work. And uh, Navid, when he when he wants to see me, he actually usually cancels. But today he's here. Regina so. never cancelled. And I was actually very punctual today, Regina. Let's be real. Yeah, and he drove me here. So whenever Navid's here, it's a yes from me. Woohoo! 
<laughs> so guys, right now we're at the Greek, the real Greek restaurant. So the reason why I bought Regina here today is because I'm on a strict diet. I feel like the food here is a really healthy option. So yeah, so sorry Regina, I hope you like it. Let's go, Let's go guys. We have chicken, we have prawns, we have fish, we have Greek salad. That's hummus, yes. and that's the spicy feta. Okay, I don't enjoy! Know what that is. So we've come to Pan and Ice, we're getting two being kind makes you cool. <laughs> and this is the final product, and then the end of the vlog, Good night. Shout out to all the lovers, supporters, haters. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, thank you for tuning in, and... See y'all later. Okay.